So we'll be doing a lot of reuse, reissue, that sort of thing. And this Darth Maul is technically a new figure, but this is the same Darth Maul that came with the uh, the Bloodfin Speeder, the San Diego Comic-Con exclusive. It's just, well, <laughs> no cloak, because why would we want a cloak with him? Uh, but it is the same figure. So we'll go ahead and just take a look at it. I'm not going to do a comparison with the other one because we know it's the same figure. This is number five in the Phantom Menace series. Um, so let's open it up and check it out. So here's our Darth Maul. Now, it's got a, such a better face sculpt than we had in that original version, which was from the original Black Series Wave. Um, better legs, better cloak, all that stuff. Or I should say better skirt. You can see the skirt's actually multiple layers here, which is kind of nice to get a better effect on it. Um, and he's got the butterfly joints in the shoulders, uh, the overlay of the, the cloak over the, uh, the main body there. It's a nice figure. <laughs> Lots of paint there, isn't there? It'd been kind of nice maybe if they did a wash of like sand or something like he's on Tatooine. But I guess if he doesn't have his cloak, well, he can't be on Tatooine. Here's his lightsaber. Ooh, we got red on there. Look at that. Okay. And you can pull it apart. So, you know. Very few Darth Maul lightsabers have been made that you couldn't pull apart. All in all, it's a nice figure. It's just if you already got the Comic-Con version, well, you've already got this. And, of course, there's the GameStop 3-pack coming, too, here soon, which is another one of these, just, again, with the cloak. But that one comes with Qui-Gon and Obi-Wan with cloaks. Ooh, exciting. So there is our new Darth Maul Black Series. I think these are starting to hit stores out there.